<laughs> All right, so knees down, heads down, eyes closed, snitch is loose. Where is he running? Nobody knows. Mystery. Brooms up. I like Quidditch because... I like Quidditch because... I like Quidditch because... It's a sport that you get to meet people of all different ty types of backgrounds, not just athletics. It allows you to feel like you're kind of participating in the Harry Potter world a little bit. Um, I like Quidditch because I look ridiculous and I don't care, and it's a lot of fun. Fantastic group of people, uh, the team we call ourselves family. So Quidditch is a fictional sport created by J.K. Rowling uh, in the Harry Potter series. And so it's basically played by a bunch of witches and wizards. And what it is is basically two teams fly around on broomsticks, try and throw a ball through one of three hoops, while people are uh, trying to throw other balls at them. And then while all this is going on, uh, you have a snitch, which is in the books or movies, it's a small little ball with wings and it flies around really fast and it's hard to find and see and the seekers try and grab it and that basically wins the game for your team. Here it's an actual person so they're they're like dressed in all gold and they have a little uh, tennis ball and sock around their waist and that's what people are trying to grab. Since the snitch isn't a player on either team, they're neutral, they can pretty much do whatever they want. So we set out boundaries so at UVic for example it would be the ring road. But once they engage the seekers they can like throw them to the ground, they can like uh, we've had people grab squirt guns and like just spray them and so their job is to basically just raise a little hell. No hands. No arm snitch. We have Armless snitch. Oh. Oh, there's a snitch snatch. And I thought the Quidditch was a great one that you got to really work hard. You, you'd be doing the warm-ups and you'd tackle people. You'd really get in the mud and you'd have enough exercise, but you know that you can't take yourself seriously while you're on a broom, which is my favorite part is just being on a broom and running around. We do our warm-ups on a broom. I've heard stories of people going to the gym and being on treadmills on a broom and just like the silliness of it all where like eventually you have to realize where the sport came from and that's like this magical world and so the sport is magical in itself is that you get to have the brooms and the guy dressed in gold, the snitch running around and just being silly and I love the silliness of the sport. The easiest way to describe Quidditch would be a mix of uh, rugby, dodgeball and flag football. Um, but in the most sense, it's exactly like rugby. I dislocated my shoulder twice from Quidditch. It's full contact. Uh, you can only tackle people who have the ball. Very similar to rugby in that sense. And passing is every direction. So um, you could have forward pass, backward pass. Doesn't really matter. So it's a bit, bit chaotic. I've actually gotten to fly around the world for Quidditch. Um, went to New York last year and this summer we went to Oxford, England. There was originally going to be, for the London Games, there was going to be a demonstration of Quidditch and it was going to be the UK versus the USA. And basically everyone was sort of like, why is it only you two? Like, why don't we just get a bunch of other countries to join? So France joined in. Australia joined in, we joined in. I, I actually organized the Canadian team, and, uh, but we didn't, most of us didn't know each other. I, mean, and I knew Steven and Leela from our team, and David from the UBC team, but the rest of the team was from just across Canada, and so we actually just met up basically that morning, and just immediately we just felt like a team. In the round robin tournament we play second, which is how we'd like to look at it, but after that we were all exhausted and just couldn't run anymore and we ended up losing and placing uh, fourth overall. It, it would just be so much more intense and like dangerous but like fun if you could actually fly around on brooms, but if only, we're, n we're not any of those crazy people who actually think that's possible, but 
Yeah, in, in my dreams, that would be nice.